Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for the episode of Uncensored Solar TV, brought to you by my amazing team here, Solar Wolf Energy. And I want to bring, a th bring something to your attention today that I feel like those of us who are in the solar industry are kind of just going along with and kind of buying into the hype. Those who are not in the industry just kind of expect this. And I'm here to tell all of us here that it's wrong. And my concern, what I'm talking about is this. Nobody, myself included, expects my auto insurance to go down next year. I don't expect my property taxes to go down. I don't expect the price of milk to be cut by 20%. And yet, for some reason... Buyers and consumers, commercial clients, and most people even in solar somehow believe and suspect and just accept that next year solar is going to be cheaper. Why? Why should it go down? Why, if everything else is going up, a, a shipping container ship that brings containers from China or from other countries into Los Angeles port, harbor, whatever, right? Bringing containers in. The cost for them to do that next year will go up. Makes sense, right? We don't think Ford's going to say, hey, look, we've been making so much money with the F-150s we've been selling for decades and decades. We'd like to throw you a bone and cut by $10,000 off right off the top. That's never going to happen. And yet none of us suspect that. But for some reason, we're led to believe and start undercutting each other in the industry and undersell everyone else because, hey, it's supposed to go down. Well, I'm here to say that needs to stop. Somebody needs to publicly say it. And if it has to be us at Solar Wolf, then fine. Mark us your bad guy. Whatever you need to do. Wear your escape goat, however you want to put it. But it ends now. Those of you in the industry, I'd like you to share this video. I'd like you to share it so that we all put this on as a unified front and be like, you know what, look, we all are valuable, trained, licensed, and expertise-filled individuals. And not one of us should be looking to make less next year. Everyone in the industry. The oil industry doesn't do this. Why should we? The coal industry doesn't do this. Why should we? We're worth more every time we learn something. And the clients, they're getting a better value because as we all get better, they get a better experience. They get a better product. They get a more efficient panel, right? Let's break down our own industry and take a look at this. Those who sell us insurance, we have general liability insurance. We have commercial auto insurance for our trucks and vehicles, whether you be a sales team or an install team or you're both. We have workman's comp. None of these things go down. Okay, great. We all rent space to park our trucks, our offices or whatever, right? This doesn't get cheaper year after year. The tools we have to purchase, the ladders, the wrenches, the impact guns, all of those things are required to install solar. They don't get cheaper. The work boots that the men, men and women are supposed to be wearing on the roof, they go up in value. Why is it? Facebook for, for, for marketing, Google for marketing, right? Why is it we're supposed to be cheaper though next year? Why is that? How are we supposed to be cheaper? So when a client, a prospective client or customer asks you, well, aren't you guys supposed to be cheaper than yet? Let me ask you a question, man or woman who owns, let's just say a liquor store that we're at trying to, you know, explain the value of a 25 KW system or a 75 KW system, whatever it is. Does, uh, does Corona charge less this year than it did three years ago to say the product? Well, no. So why should I be cheaper? Right? Just makes sense. A real look needs to be given into this entire industry. And perhaps a top down needs to be done. And I, and I would hope and I expect that this video gets shared amongst the industry and we start questioning this because we all deserve it. I feel like if we're going to start 
looking at solar and taking solar as serious as it is and with the current administration in place trying to make solar the replacement end all be all why would it go down in cost it should go up in cost so let's stop making that a real thing thanks for watching the episode of uncensored solar tv brought to you by those amazing folks here in solar wolf energy thanks